Welcome to the Pre-Coat Surface Pretreatment Application video. The procedure in this training video was developed specifically for small general aviation aircraft. For pre-coat procedures on large aircraft, please contact Pantheon Enterprises. Also, as a reminder, always refer to and follow your facility's specific engineering documents and safety procedures. At the end of this video, you will find contact information for Pantheon Enterprises. If you have any questions, we're here to support you 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. All right, let's begin. In this video, we'll cover what pre-coat is and what tools you'll need to apply it. Then, we'll take you through the standard process step by step. What is pre-coat? Well, pre-coat replaces conversion coatings. It prepares metal and composite for primer and paint. Essentially, pre-coat makes the paint stick, which prevents peeling and corrosion. A major advantage of pre-coat is that it cuts process time. It replaces four chemicals and processes, including the alkaline wash, acid etch, conversion coating, and solvent wipe. Another important advantage of pre-coat is that it's non-toxic, biodegradable, and is recognized by the Environmental Protection Agency. To apply pre-coat, you will need the following. Pole scrubbers, abrading pads, now this is important, please be sure to use aluminum oxide pads that are between 280 and 400 grit. We recommend the Maroon Scotch Brights part number 7447. For military use, please consult a technical order. You'll also need sprayers with a tip size of 0.065 to 0.071 inches, pre-coat, it comes ready to use so there's no mixing necessary, orbital abraders or jitterbugs may be used. They will increase adhesion so they are great to use in the high erosion areas. Lastly, we recommend goggles and gloves. Pre-coat is non-toxic, but always consult and follow your facility's safety and PPE guidelines. Now that you have the tools, let's review the pre-coat process. The way you process the aircraft will obviously depend on the crew size, but here are some general guidelines. Work in sections about 6 feet by 6 feet. Work each section moving from the tail forward. Note that you will apply pre-coat twice, first scrubbing in one direction and then the other. This ensures that all areas have been thoroughly processed. All right, step one, spray pre-coat in the six foot by six foot section. Using the pole scrubbers with the Scotch-Brite, scrub the pre-coat into a rich lather using vertical or up and down motion. Be sure to overlap strokes so that you cover the entire area. Pay close attention to leading edges and high erosion areas. Do not rinse the pre-coat or allow the pre-coat foam to dry. If it does, simply reapply the pre-coat and scrub again. Next, spray another coat of pre-coat over the foamed area you just scrubbed. This time, scrub the pre-coat in a horizontal or left-to-right motion. Again, be sure to overlap the strokes and pay close attention to leading edges and high erosion areas. Now that you've applied and scrubbed twice, you're ready to rinse the section. Always rinse from the top down. Now, move to the next 6x6 section and continue this process for each section. When all sections have been processed, remove all the masking. Inspect the aircraft and rinse any areas where pre-coat foam remains, ensuring the entire aircraft is clean. Once the aircraft is dry, you are ready to prime. Be sure to prime within 24 hours though. This is to ensure that the skin does not become contaminated with materials such as dust. There are some things to keep in mind. The type of abrasive pad is important. Please use only the recommended type. Do not allow pre-coat to dry during either application. Do not rinse the pre-coat between applications. Remember, you apply and scrub twice before rinsing the section. 
Do not wait to prime the aircraft. You don't want the aircraft to become contaminated prior to priming. Lastly, do not solvent wipe the aircraft after the pre-coat application. If, for any reason, by accident, these things do occur, simply start over. Thank you for choosing Precoat Surface Pretreatment. If you have any questions, we are here to support you 24 hours a day, 7 days a week.